under 1700 Blitzavina. Maybe we can pick up from the GM Tranquilizer Arena. We had loads of advantages, but um, the speed element at the end of the game seemed to let us down because we kept losing on time. So that's not a good position, that's not a good state to be in. Let's just grab it here. Wants to exchange, so his knight can attack our pawn. Wants to attack the pawn again. Let's go here, no point putting the knight there, he's just going to drop his pawn down. Yep. Looking for the knight to come here, attack this pawn. Bishop doesn't defend, let's attack this pawn. It's attacking our bishop, bring the bishop back, I suppose. Bishop now attacks, so we could take his could go here, could go there. Let's attack the bishop. Got two pieces to attack. Double the pawns in front of the king. Might not be a good thing though, because his rooks are gonna actually. I'm gonna do it anyway. His rooks will own this file here. Um, could push this pawn. Let's uh, push that one. His king's going across. It's not to, at the moment. Let's go here. This pawn's weak. Oh, this pawn is so weak. Let's go here. It's just going to give us loads of things to think about. It's attacking the pawn on that side. Let's go here. It doubles up his rocks. Ah, damn. Damn, 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 damn. Oh. Oh, that happened so quick, didn't it? Won all the tempo and it look at that bishop move. Oh, oh, it's not right. It's not right. Oh, give me strength. Oh, it makes no difference. Damn, it wins the pawn. Oh, damn, damn, owns the file. There's nothing to be done now. This pawn, or he's got that pawn, whichever. It's probably oh, shabby. Scrap this one. This pawn comes flying down. Ah oh, man. Ah, oh, sad day. Sad day. Ah, oh, give me strength. It's no good to me. Oh, I could have just pushed that pawn to protect the pawn, never mind. Yeah, it's got me jammed in, hasn't it? It's got me jammed in. Mm. all over the place 40 seconds uh, what did we learn from the got to move fast now just quick quick moves oh and they've resigned oh Ah, right. 
It's okay. Akim. Because even in the ones in the GM um, game, the arena, we got lovely positions, we had advantages in material, etc. It's just the time seemed to run out dead quick. So I don't think there's anything wrong with the game that we're playing, it's just a matter of time management and the people are just using that. It's not, it is a skill, I suppose it is a skill because you, you're playing the rules of the game. Yeah, and which is basically playing in time, but it's again, you're like thinking, but well, are you playing chess or is it, is it just a speed game? Let's just capture this here. So strategy and all that sort of stuff seems to sort of disappear. Yeah, if you're getting a nice, if you're doing nice moves, but you're not fast enough, then you're still losing the game. So the idea about is to, oh, we could go there, but we're not going to do that. Let's attack the knight. He's got my pawn here, so that might be wrong, but we could also, oh, um, let's go for the exchange pawn onto the knight. So again, like in this game here, feels okay, you know, it feels strong, we're developing, putting pressure onto the opponent. But then there's that, oh, what's going on here? Let's just capture this. And just uh, x-ray through to the rook, onto the king. But losing on time is just so painful. We're obviously going to grab that. And look to double up, I think. Um, something like that. Does have a nice knight. So we'll have to go back to defend. So he's got one of my pawns with his knight. So he's got a flexible knight which can be used against us. His rook goes back. Uh, just bring the rook here. And to attack here. And he's, um, it's fully fledged. Let's go here. first space at some stage or is it just a continuous uh, draw uh, yeah, it looks like a drawish type thing don't it I think I'm doing this wrong I come here. So this rook can't come then now to put a background checkmate on so that's um, Quite nice. Come here. He's coming for the background checkmate now. Yeah. So I think we'll just give the king a flight square. <clears throat> just push ourselves up. Uh, oh no! Can you believe what I've just seen? Oh, give it up. Oh, are you joking me? Oh, oh no, on the dying seconds. Oh, he's left his rook, mate. Oh, dear me. 
Um, shall we protect this part? Come on, I've got to move faster now. I cannot lose on time. Oh man, I can't believe that night fork. Unbelievable. And it's lucky they left the night there to be taken. And the time is running out, so we're probably going to win on time. Crikey, unbelievable. This is... Uh, Right, okay, let's get back in. Speed, speed. Uh, ooh, let's grab this. Let's grab that. Let's oh, Queen is down. It's got a two on one on the pawn. Do we do? Do we protect it? Do we protect it like this? But if we do that, then no. I'm gonna have to cast off, lose the pawn. Fair enough. Let's just grab here. Let's push on here. And his bishop's looking to come down here. Oh, he's got all the dirty tactic tricks going on. Yeah, all the quick, you know, the quick win patterns. He's got them down pat. got them all sewn up so if we go here now his queen takes rook queen takes so then we've got the free thing so that's okay okay let's go for let's go for that and let's go for that at least we're owning this fight he's gonna have to move his bishop now hopefully he forgets no he doesn't forget he's attacking our pawn on this side here so we could actually just maybe crunch it up a bit attack the bishop Take me the pawn, maybe. These pawns, are, yeah, I was just going to say these pawns look fairly strong, don't they? Let's go here. This bishop can actually take this and attack his rook. And we could come central. I think we're going to have to go here. This bishop's going to take this pawn because he's got a background checkmate thing going on. Let's just push here. So this bishop will take again. Oh, it's not taking that pawn. Ah, so let's go here, take, take that. He's got these two pawns now that are going to cause me some serious problems. I have to get my king over. Yeah, I think we've lost this one. Uh, yes, we have lost this one. Damn, yeah, okay, slight, slight error. He's got a poor majority massive style on this far side here, the A. So I don't think I can do anything. These are equal, so let's go here. And let's go there. So that's all blocked down now. Don't really want to go on a dark square because obviously he's um, got a dark square bishop. And I think that's the game. Damn, okay. Well, you can't win them all. Yes, yeah, so he's coming down now. There's nothing much to do really. Uh, let's go here. Just capture, I suppose. This king goes up, goes over for our bishop. Not much to do really. He's going to exchange off the bishop because he wants this pawn to come best. Yeah. Let's go here. Just go there. 
wants to exchange off. Uh, it's not a right lot to do, really. This king drops down, but it doesn't drop down. And I'm stuck in the corner, and he goes off and gets this pawn. Ah, uh, yeah, fair enough. Yeah, blocks my passageway. Goes to the side. That's it. Job done. Back to the tournament. Like I say, you can't win them all. I think I messed up a bit of a tempo there. Um, I, I believe I had a bit of an advantage, and I think I messed up my move order. So let's get cracking again. Uh, let's not chase that bishop because they never take anyway. Well, let's do it now. Now that that's happened, let's go here. I didn't think they were going to do that particular move. And last but not least, let's go here. And could do that, but I'm going to just. Yeah. Okay, so flank attack, flank attack, let's. Just attack the knight, see if he wants to play. Uh, what just happened there? I just lost the pawn. Bishop here blocking off. Mm, yeah, okay. You can tell sort of straight off when you've um, made a bit of a mess of the opening. I think this is kind of a bit of a messy opening. I've I've let them get a pawn or a knight rather. <laughs> I've let them get a piece without uh, without any compensation really. Let's go here. Block my white square bishop. Yeah. Okay. I feel like resigning this one already. I think I'm trying to make up for speed, and I shouldn't be doing that. I should be just playing my game. I get more advantages when I play my game it's just a matter of the speed element, speed element later on in the game seems to let me down it's just tromping down with these pawns let's go here ooh, ooh, let's attack here Constantly moving the knight, so it's got some sort of system in place. What do we want to do? Let's go here. Rook rover. In readiness for trying to just bishop's going to take this pawn and we'll see how it goes from there and he's blocking all of that off i'm gonna take it anyway yeah i feel like taking this but uh, might not work yet let's just bring it back Queen to here looks devastating, but I think he's going to go for a queen exchange of some sort. Let's go here. Rook will probably have to move, maybe. Just go up here. So I'm trying to claw something back from a bad opening, I'm trying to put pressure on the king, Gary. But the, it's not got it's not got many um, it's not got many legs to it really. Let's go here. And he does capture. It captures with the rook. That might have been too much pressure for them. Um, psh, let's go here. Just covering this square. Attack here. Queen can capture. Just bring the queen up. We'll leave the king there for now. He's, he's, he's tightly protected. Pawn takes, bishop takes, queen's on the bishop, queen's on the bishop again, oh no but he drops the pawn doesn't he, he drops the pawn so we're going to have to do that, and he's 
coming down for our king, so I'm gonna have to move the king up. It doesn't do that. Um, is he doing something stealthy? Bishop can still put a check on the king here. Attacking the rook. Rook's a bit closed in. And da -da 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 Let's put a check. My king is on a dark square, you know. I need to make sure I'm lively to that. Yeah, let's go here. It's coming for the pawn. Let's go here. dark square, that's not good. It's going for it, it's got eight seconds left, so uh, let's go up. Five seconds, I don't think there can be that much done now. It's got a two on one on that pawn anyway, so he can actually take. And just bring the queen here. Yes, and we win on time. And we weren't doing too bad either, so that's not too bad. Excellent. Okay, on to the next one. Okay, just take my time a little bit. Just do my normal openings nice and steady. Queen's out, so let's go here. Castle. Could now look to push through the centre before the bishop takes effect. Attacking the knight. Doesn't want to exchange. Just attack the knight here. Quick grab. Maybe just bring it back here. So let's pawn up. Anything unprotected at the minute? No, it's doing like a rope a type thing. Oh look at that. Look at that, he's on the, on the knight. Queen's overworked now, basically defending the knight, which is not really what I want to be doing. Let's bring the bishop back. Anything to attack yet? No 2 on ones This one's got no protection on. Now his knight's getting in the game. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna have to take. I don't like that confusion. And just move the rook off of the diagonal. To here, to here. To there. Now his bishop's got this attack here, but it's not. His queen's come down for the pawn. He's got a two on one. He's got a two on one on the knight. Maybe I should have put my rook here. Yee, 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 yee. Oh, drat and a drat. Oh, cleverness. Got a two on one, and I don't have anywhere to go. Oh, that's disappointing. I can't attack anything. There's bishop, bishop. He's got, everything's covered off. Hmm, interesting. Right, I'm resigning that one. Yeah. Oh, every time I fall for it, shouldn't do that. I lose a pawn. It looks nice, but then. <laughs> oh, that's because I'm a bit mad about that um, last game, really. Okay, so trying to wear claw back the pawn. I might as well just uh, go for an exchange. Get it out of the way. Doesn't go for the exchange, so let's go here. His dark square bishop's a bit blocked in at the minute, so that potentially could be an advantage. So the additional pawn they've got, he's got doubled up, his bishop's blocked behind it, so not really taking too much advantage of that, which is good. So I'd say it's equalised because of the double pawns and the oh oh and he's got his bishop, but that's okay. And there, uh, okay. So let's just block everything down a little bit. See if we can get them onto white squares if possible. This pawn's going to push down. Yep. Let's go here. He's going to have to bring his bishop here to defend that pawn or oh, his king even. Uh, bring the king up. Don't really want to be on a dark square, but I am. 
y square for me here and that's fairly locked down let's bring that one up could potentially be a draw even though they're plus one this reminds me of a game that I had in, in the recent 4 NCL um, let's go here let's go there yeah I could have pushed this pawn onto this pawn to get my bishop developed so nobody's going to take that chance now he's trying to get and trying to put some pressure on this area here with his king and the pawn so we could, if we captured he captures and captures or we can push up or we can just leave it oh he might just lock down if he locks down then it's a draw So the benefit was having these two doubled pawns here. Oh, he's actually trying to go for the win. So he might do actually. If his king goes across, then down there. Oh, it's a tempo thing. But I've got the bishop protecting that square, so he can't actually go down with the king. Oh, but his bishop's there. So we could actually put a check on his king. His king has to move out of the way. Bishop's still protecting that square. And if we go across here, if his king moves there, then we can take more well, we take that pawn because the king, yeah, he does move there. Um, there's a my king cat moving here, so he's probably looking to win on time. So it's, there's nothing to do now. Yeah, he's, he's looking to win on time. Oh, yeah, draw. <laughs> oh, we're getting half decent at this malarkey. Okay, off we go again. It's got 16 minutes left of this um, tournament. And so it's tacking the knight. Let's just bring the pawn up. And uh, I'm just bring the bishop here. And evaluation shows that this type of opening that I do isn't the best type of way to deal with this situation. Let's go here. This pawn was going to push. Let's push here. Let's grab. Yeah, so it's pushing the pawn down. This, if this knight disappeared, but it's probably going to still push this pawn here, isn't it? Mm. So it's pressuring our king Gary already. Oh, okay. So if this knight disappeared, like I said, then we can actually take this pawn. So if the rook takes, then the queen takes the rook. And uh, he's got a two on one. Okay, fair enough. He's got a two on one there. Because the knight or the bishop can take. Yeah. Yeah, where's his knight wanting to go? Let's just push this onto here so that the bishop doesn't have a bit of strength on the b-pole. Still going down anyway. Let's go here because it gets my bishop. His bishop, his knight. Good. Let's develop the knight. Queen's got a check on his king. It's just a small thing, but okay. Got the horizontal coming across here towards his uh, rook. Rook comes down and attacks us, reverses the situation. Let's attack the bishop, maybe he doesn't see this. Or maybe I've not seen something that they're planning because his rook is in king area. His queen has got the diagonal, he doesn't see it. But is he thinking there's something better? Queen down. And we can grab this here. But does his queen have a check on me yet? No, nope, not yet. And if the king takes, queen. Ah, oh, they've resigned. Go! Oh! oh, well chuffed. I think that's my last one now. There's only 13 minutes left of it.